Hey you guys, it is Roshi Ball. What is up to my real shenanigans? I just want to come on here real quick and show you guys my hair. I did put my hair back in twist. And these are the same twists I did a couple weeks ago when I had the expressions. Um, the springy afro kinky twist. And I've seen a lot of, a couple of YouTubers use this hair. Um, this is also the hair that I had in yesterday when I posted the video of me with the big old bushy, bushy, bushy high bun ponytail thing that's this hair i took that loose since then and decided to twist my hair back up i got up at seven something this morning took a shower did whatever and i started working on my hair um it took me four hours i started working on it a little past eight and i was watching some stuff from transformation tv um well i've been watching transformation church on youtube you guys should check it out and sometimes you have to go back and sometimes read read the word again or go back and just give yourself a refresher and a reminder of what what god can do that's all so that's what i had to do this morning and just remember um that i need to have unconsistent non-stoppable faith and it has to be genuine like consistent because i don't know what i was doing the faith that I thought I was faithing wasn't faithing at all. So I don't know what that was, but I had to go back and just give myself a reminder of why I need faith to have a relationship with God too. And my prayer life has to increase and all of the above. So anyway, I came on here to show you guys, not only to share that, which I'm glad I did, but I want to show you guys this hair. I did my twist better this time than I did the first time. Because I actually was able to take my time. I think the first time I did a lot of rushing. That's why I didn't look as good. You can still see a little bushy part sticking out. But that's okay. I think it's supposed to do that. Oh, some, some of it is still coming out. Look. So, yeah. So far, I'm liking the hair the second time around that I put this in. There's still a couple of long ones. But I kind of like that look. So I'm going to bring some down like this. Um, I had to cut two of them because, yeah, they were getting super longer than the other ones. So I had to cut them. So if you see any blunt ones like this one, then because I had to cut it. But anyway, um, yeah. I love my hair the second time around. Let's get into some partage. Well, as you can see, the partery in the front is neat. And around the perimeter is neat. In the back going up to the middle not so much you can tell i mean it's tight but you can tell that oh i'm trying to hurry and get finished because i don't care how i part i can't see it nobody's gonna see it no way unless i wear my hair like this and even so ain't nobody gonna be thinking about that this weather makes you want to go to the beach but anyway um because if it was gloomy i'll be asleep right now but anyway yeah so i'm i'm gonna take care of my hair a little bit more better Stay away from the wigs for a while. Um, I have some hair clip extensions coming whenever um, they decided to ship it. And because I know they stopped the airlines right now. And I'm still waiting on a couple of things that I got from, that I ordered from AliExpress. But um, due to the coronavirus, they have to stop certain airlines. So certain packages won't be here until the end of April. And they, um, on, I'm going back and forth with customer service of AliExpress trying to make sure everything's okay. And they're still telling me due to the virus, you know, this is why your package is not here. And this is why this package is not here. And that one came and this one didn't something. Okay. Thanks for the update. I'll be patient and wait. Thank you. I ordered um, a bushy ponytail hair clip extensions and some heels, which I got. Already, I gotta. I'm gonna show you guys that those heels that I got from AliExpress, and um, um, those heels came, and I ordered all that stuff on February 3rd, and it is March 27th, I believe. So, like I said, um, I have to wait until they're able to let the airlines go because right now they stopped it due to the virus. So, I get it. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely happy I decided to do something else to my hair. I'm definitely going to keep this as long as I can. And as soon as Wild Beauty Supply opens back up, because they're close too, I'm going to get another color. Hopefully, like, I want it to be either like a red ombre color or more of a the honey blonde, almost like a 
27, color number 27. Like if you want that gold brownish look, I want to do something like that. Or I might just start off with number four. I don't know. We'll see. But um, I like the way I did my hair this second time around. I really do. And I'm hoping to get in to more of this type of styles. Like um, the ones, the, the springy twist that I got from Amazon.com. I need to get those again because that was nice. Um, I should come on here and just do different styles for you guys. That's what I wanted to do in the first place. Just to give my channel a little more content since I'm going to be at home four days a week. Plus sun Saturday and Sunday. I only go to work Monday. Um, they still got us working. But, oh, whatever. I still get paid 40 hours. But, yeah. So, that's not what I came here to talk about. What I came here to talk about is my twist. And I'm really loving my twist. At all times. I love my twist. I, I'm telling you, I did this way better the second time, which is now, than I did the first time. Because the first time was not hitting it like this. It wasn't hitting at all. But, um, you guys stay tuned. I'm going to show you guys the heels that I had purchased from AliExpress. Hang on. Hey, you guys, I'm back. These are the heels that I purchased. They're size, um, ooh, that's a bit small. Hold on. I ordered a size 9, and these are size... Okay, it doesn't say the size, but I ordered size 9. And these are the heels that I picked up. These are not real red bottoms, you guys. I promise you. They're red bottoms cousin. Sped bottoms. I don't know. But yeah. But um, from far away, you can't tell. They look very expensive from far away, right? See, I'm a fake it till you make it type of person. And I'm a type of person that if I don't got something, if I got a replica of something, I'm going to make it work. Like it's the real deal, okay? Um, When I get on here, and I make sure you guys... um my glasses collection i promise I, I, not promise but I, I believe i have over 60 pairs of glass sunglasses i do the last time i counted i have 40 or close to 39 so anytime i go somewhere and see a weird pair of glasses i'm gonna get them so if we were to go to venice beach and they have glasses that's two for twenty dollars i'm gonna grab me some i need some big huge elton john lens big huge space cases weird looking too big and for somebody else to wear like in other words you know some things are too big and people feel like a little ashamed of wearing it no i don't think so not for me i gotta be different but um back to the shoes so these shoes that i bought were about um i want to say eight dollars and something from aliexpress or it could have been nine something for aliexpress yeah so i'm still waiting on the hair clip extensions and the bushy ponytail that i ordered from aliexpress because i definitely had these coming along with it and they told me because of the order or whatever they can't you know because of the coronavirus excuse me they can't send my order right now but these came so okay but whatever so we have to wait till everything is safe um and cool and everything but anyway i wanted to come on here to show you guys my hair once again this is um i believe I don't know how the length this was, though, because I don't think it listed it on the paper. But um, this is color number 1B. And I only use a pack and a half. I bought three all together, but the first time I did the twist, I used two packs. Because I did them a little bit bigger. That's why they, don't, they look neater now, because I did them a little bit smaller than before. I started to go super small, judging from this one, which is the one I did in the back corner. They look super smaller than these because I just went a little smaller just so I can save some of the hair because out of three packs, I used two the first time and I used and I used half of the bundle for the third pack and then I had two bundles and a half to complete all of this this morning, which again is the same hair that I had in that huge bushy ponytail yesterday in the video and I decided to put it to some good use and I had little bitty balls of hair left that I could have stretched out and saved for another time in case I need to redo one or in case I have a, a braid that I forgot to you know twist or whatever 
No, I was able to finish this in four hours. I'm glad I did my hair like this. I'm starting to learn how to do my hair all in one day. As opposed to, um, so this took me eight days because I had to go to work and I had to come back and go to school. Then I had to wash the kids, fry fish, go cook, this and that. And people take a long time doing their hair. I want to practice do, learning how to do my hair one day, even if it's micro braids. I don't care how long I have to be up. I want to finish the braids until it's done. And I'm very proud of myself that I was able to finish this ha this hairdo um, in four hours. Because when you two strands, when you two strand twisting something or crocheting something, it shouldn't take you no time. And this didn't take me no time that much. All I did was watch something real good on TV, and next thing you know, I was done. That's how it happens when you're putting in braids, taking it out. And if you crocheting it in, it should take no time. So yeah. So yeah. So once again, I used to, to complete this hairdo. I used the Expressions Springy Kinky Afro Twist or something like that, and it gives it a very natural look. And I can put it kind of back up some kind of way, but I can't do that right now because it's too tight. I just finished it a couple of hours ago. So yeah. So that's that's been my video, you guys. I'm about to chill out and see if I can take a nap. Cause I just finished lunch. I just had me some spicy noodles. That's it. And I drank some juice. I need to drink some water. You know, I need to fill my water up. Look. So I think I might take a little field trip later on today. Go fill that water bottle up. And I have a whole water bottle right here. I need to drink. So, um, that's what I'll be doing. Just so I can get out and get some fresh air. I say that cause I don't know what's going on over here, but I want to make sure I'm taking all the proper precautions and I'm being safe. And I hope everybody is. Being safe out there too. Remember, wash your hands. Okay? Roma Rain said the best. Wash your hands because you want to stay clean. Wash your hands because you want to stay clean. Yes, sir. Also, too, um, I'm going to go ahead and get into this video that Christina LaRae just posted. Um, I think she's about to draw Lizzie McGuire or something. So I want to see how that looks. And I get so inspired by her. Thank you so much for sharing, girl. I want to shout you out. Beautiful drawings. Thank you so much. And thank you, Lord. Um, and thank you sh for sharing your love for the Lord as well. <laughs> thank you, Lord, for sharing your love for Christina Lorray. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. I'm tired. And it's, not, it's way past the afternoon, you guys. So I'll see you guys later. Don't want to be before you long. Bye.